people will believe in you and come around you only when you are winning. And so you must learn to believe in yourself when you are losing. Let your dreams be bigger than your fears, your actions louder than your words, and your faith stronger than your feelings. I've come to discover that life can sometimes scare you to the point that you may be tempted to give up on certain pursuits because of how difficult or impossible they may look. Especially when you have a dream that seems to others like you are odd amongst them because they haven't thought of thinking that far or dreaming that big. Even you yourself can sometimes be scared of your own dreams and aspirations because they appear unprecedented and when you look at your history and bloodline, it appears like no one has ever done such a thing before. The truth, however, is that is the very nature of a dream. If it were not irrational or out of reach, it would not be worth dreaming about. It would not create warm, fuzzy feelings in your heart as you think about it. If it did not challenge your understanding of the world as it is, then it would not be enough to motivate you to do the sometimes irrational things necessary to bring it to fruition. I've come to realize that there is real power in dreams. However, with every dream comes the reality of overcoming the obstacles necessary to achieve them. These obstacles may appear daunting, insurmountable, and absolutely terrifying. The actions you might be required to take to achieve your dream may appear irrational, inconceivable, or even wasteful. But remember, dreaming is free. Rather than limiting them, make them much bigger than your fears. Let them consume your waking hours and fuel your every move. Let them permeate your soul and emanate from you in a glow discernible by everyone that comes in contact with you. Release your dreams from the slavery of your mind and chart a path today to make them real. I've personally achieved many things in my life, but I've never stopped dreaming and my latest dream is the biggest one I've ever had. Now, I'm not a guru or an expert. I'm just like you. The only difference may be that I have decided that whatever way possible, I will do everything to make the remainder of my dreams come true. I will not settle for anything less than what I've dreamed about. Yes, I know that it is scary and the journey to your dreams and future looks gloomy. There are no signs of help coming from anywhere. There are no proofs that even God will bring a miracle. Whatever the case may be, even while others around us are giving up, we must keep going. Though some may think that we are foolish, we must not be influenced by them, but simply press on. It's too far to go back. The side roads are dangerous. We cannot stop here and we must go on for the Lord shall be with us. Always have this in mind that what you carry inside of you is greater than what may be happening around you. The Bible says in the book of 1 John 4 verse 4 that, But you belong to God, my dear children. You have already won a victory over those people because the spirit who lives in you is greater than the spirit who lives in the world. No matter how real the challenge and the fears are, no matter the opposition that may come your way like what happened in the life of Joshua when he was told to lead the people of Israel, let your dreams be far greater than your fears. This is why the word of God said to Joshua in the book of Joshua 1 verses 7 through 9. Be strong and very courageous. Be careful to obey all the law my servant Moses gave you. Do not turn from it to the right or to the left, that you may be successful wherever you go. Keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Beloved, the Lord is with you. If you believe that he is your help and your shield and your exceedingly great reward, then you will see his hand in whatever and wherever you go. It's natural to fear when things look difficult and impossible. 
But the fact that it is difficult and appears impossible does not mean that is the true reality. The truth is every mountain seems great until the person decides to climb it. We have been built with much strength to be able to deal with whatever may come our way. And if you are a believer, then you must understand that the inner working power of God inside you is much greater than whatever challenge may confront your life. There is much light in us that can quench every darkness around our lives. So therefore, let nothing stop you. You are closer than you first began. It's doable. It's possible. And though it might appear difficult, always have this mentality and mindset towards what you dream about in life. Some of your plans and dreams may be buried and missed mistakes you've made. But Jesus is the answer for all. Jesus is the one who takes what you messed up and turns it into something good. You don't have to hang your head because of something you did in the past. Instead, thank God for Jesus the Restorer. When you fall, he will pick you and brush you off, so to speak. He will forgive you and say, it's going to be all right, my child. Now go and live for me and do not condemn yourself. Thank God for Jesus and his restoration power. He can take all that God has given you, that which you've let lie dormant, and resurrect it into a flame burning bright. And that flame will be what you need to accomplish great things in your life or your job, your marriage, in your finances, in your promotion, in your community, in your home, for your children, and wherever you go. No matter what you've been through or what you're facing, do not quit, my dear. I'd like to end by saying, let your dream be bigger than your fears because your dreams are temporary simulations of your possible future and the perfect reflection of the size and scope of your potential. They give you a taste of what the end will be like even before you start on your way and at the basis of every successful life. Tell yourself there's no God as big as my God. When the devil raises his head and tries anything, Tell him there is no God as big as mine. I have a very big God who is always by my side. Therefore, be not afraid of anything. Rather, let your dream be bigger than your fears. God bless you.